Good morning, and it's a nice one. We're gonna go do some stuff today. So today I'm gonna go do a brick. It's uh, Friday morning, I'm off work today. My son's on Prodi Day. So what we're gonna do is, well, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a brick workout. So I'm gonna go for a, like a 20K bike ride just around the park, come back, do a 5K runoff, and then we're gonna, you know, do the things. And then after lunch, later today in the afternoon, my son and I, Jack, are, and I are gonna go do some track repeats again. Uh, he's been showing an interest in uh, running and getting a little fitter and a little healthier. So we're gonna do that. Uh, I've got him on like, and it's good for me too. Like I benefit as well, but I've got him on like a intro to running kind of thing. So it's like run one minute, walk two minutes, and then we re repeat that five times. So it's a 15 minute workout. So totally doable. He did great last time and uh, he's looking forward to doing that again. And then he's going to his dad's tonight. So I get my house to myself. <laughs> so excited. Okay, see you on the road. Damn, it is nice out. This weather is fair, but not meant to last. I think it's supposed to get cloudy tonight. Mixed bag tomorrow and Sunday, and then rain next week. So we'll see what happens. Some construction here to get through. And uh, yeah, so tomorrow, I did manage to get into the uh, swim group, the open water swim group that I go with, Vauza. They're putting on a fall special. That's tomorrow afternoon. I'm gonna drive. <laughs> I think it's gonna be cold. I'm not gonna wanna ride my bike home. And then Sunday is supposed to be my last club ride with my club and I'm worried if it rains, they'll cancel it. And I'll be sad because I miss everybody. I haven't been out with my club since like mid-August. But that's okay. I'm sure Karen will go out for a ride with me once in a while. Okay, here we go. I'm on the flat. I'd say I just thought I'd talk to you for a sec about what I've been up to this morning. So I was up super early <laughs> again, but I'm totally reinvigorated, invigorated, invigorated <laughs> for the 2024, like in 2024 in general. But the season, I actually, I just am. Um, a lot of big changes going on and uh, all what I believe in my heart to be ones that I need to be on. And I spent the morning signing up for some races for 2024 that I wasn't sure if I wanted to do or not. So pretty excited about that. And uh, I'm uh, excited to get into full marathon training and half marathon training and I get my nutrition dialed in. Doing really good, I'm down like six pounds now. So it's fantastic. <laughs> All right, a few more minutes here and I'm gonna get on the Lionsgate Bridge and uh, I'll be climbing, so I'll see you in the park. Oh, I'm huffing a bit. <laughs> Got a PR going over the Lionsgate Bridge today. Ooh, ooh. Five minutes, five seconds, which is a good two minutes, or just under two minutes, slower than the QOM, the Queen of the Mountain on Strava. <sighs> That's fast. Clear that whole bridge deck in three minutes. <sighs> like some days that's hard to do in a car. <laughs> Anyway, I'm not trying to get the key away I'm on the bridge, just, just to be clear. But I am proud of myself for PRing my effort this morning. It's been a long time. Like I said, this is like the Lisa Renaissance. I feel like myself again. Let's go. Ah. <laughs> I did a major effort up Prospect Hill in the park. I'm not sure if I PR'd it. I'll have to check. Okay, a little recovery. Downhill, back home. So uh, here we go. Taking a shortcut over Park Royal. <laughs> Feels two big buildings. I helped with those. Still very proud of them. Okay, hopefully cars will behave in here. I'll take Marine Drive. Probably all the way to the 20th, actually. Why not? Let's take a different route home. 
See you out there. Nice and quiet in here. Apparently car indicators do not work in parking lots. <sighs> the hill gets me every time, the one home. I know I whinge about it all the time and that's not gonna stop. Okay, I'm on transition time now. I do have a brick workout running on my watch. So I'll try to be quick. I mean, this isn't gonna be like a, um, you know, a fast transition. I am in full cycling get not triathlon gear. I gotta put my running stuff on, get in the house and blah, blah, blah. So uh, yeah, plan is to go out and do 5K now, but uh, we'll see how the legs are feeling. <laughs> see you out there. And we go running. All right, seven minute, 45 second transition. Not too bad considering I had to put running tights on and putting those on when you're sweaty was a workout into itself. All right, let's roll. Came about 1.5K into this run. Just climbed up the big hill. Legs feel heavy, but that's okay. Cause the more I do this, the lighter I'll get, the better I'll get, and stronger I'll get, so I'll be quicker. Notice that I did not say easier. <laughs> it never gets easier, nothing is easy. But, the pace will improve. All right, let's go. Uh, I'm almost up. Well, I'm at the worst part of the hill. I still got, I'm still climbing here, but then I got a nice little descent. One more little climb, and then I'm pretty downhill until I have to do the big climbs home. So I'll see you there. I finished my brick. <laughs> I'm very excited. I did uh, three days recovery, yeah. I'm going exercising again this afternoon, so I'm not gonna be able to do that. But I did an hour 49 minutes uh, for my brick, 27 kilometers, just over 27 kilometers all in. Hour five on the bike, 35, 50, run the run was just over 5k so my watch ticked over at 5k and i was 34 minutes and something into it and just had just started going up the last hill to my house that i will always moan about as we know um i think a realistic goal i would like to get that time on my run I, like to 30 minutes for you know to get to my house like to do the loop I usually do and like to be able to do 34 minutes after uh, you know an hour-long bike ride with some elevation in it I mean it's not a flat ride and this was not a flat run um, I think it's pretty good I think I feel like my base fitness is starting to come back I think it's just because I've been more consistent this month of September than I have been in a long, long while. So I definitely feel like, you know, slowly getting my old self back. So I, I think it's all very good and lots of good progress is to come. But um, anyway, I want to send her out here and yatter on the way because I promised I'd make my kids some waffles when I got in. I might have some too. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I think that'll wrap this day up and tomorrow I'll bring you along again because we're going to do an open water swim with my group. It's gotta be cold. It's okay. I'm looking forward to it. I never thought swimming would be my favorite part of all this, but you know what? I love swimming in the open water. I really, really do. So I'm looking forward to doing some tomorrow. So I'll see you on the beach. I lied. I'm not heading to the ocean to go for a swim. Jack, where are we going? Uh, we're going to the track on my, at my school. We're gonna do some more track repeats. So off we go. So we're running for one minute, walking for two recoveries. This is our second lap. Three more seconds, Jack. I know. <laughs> we finished. Yeah. You did great, buddy. Yeah. And we finished just in time because there's a football game is starting. <laughs> so yeah. that was good. I think I've seen the uh, other team before. They had a, there was a football game during school. Ah, nice. 
So how was that? Yeah. It's pretty good. We did good. Yeah, I think we so did. So in our last minute here of cool, of recovery, and then uh, head back home, make some lunch. Yeah. All right, sounds good. All right, this wraps up this segment. See ya. See ya. <laughs> Alexa, turn on the bookcase lights. Good morning. It's early. Oh, it's not too early. It's 620. Mm. Today is running and swimming. <laughs> Coffee first. <laughs> I woke up. I was sleeping really well and I woke up. I heard rain outside. So I thought, oh no. But we'll see what happens. Oh, my plan is to go running with the West Van Run crew. I've never run with them before. They meet at the coffee shop down in the town. And uh, so, and I know they run in whatever the weather is, so that's fine. I'll, uh, I'll assess. Actually, let's, let's listen. Hey, Alexa, what's the weather today? Okay, it's not terrible. Not great, but, <laughs> but not terrible. I'm more concerned about what it's going to be like when I'm swimming this afternoon. So we'll see what that's like. I'll get all my stuff packed up because I'm actually pretty excited about it. I'm excited about everything. Okay, I'm gonna go make coffee and quit uh, slurring my words because I just woke up. <laughs> and uh, maybe um, the next clip I'll be back out running. Okay? All right, I'll see you there. Greetings again. All right, it's nine o'clock and I'm heading out to meet with the West Van Run crew. Never run with them before. I don't even know if they're meeting up. If they're there, great. If they're not, I'll just jog and come home. <laughs> um, it's rained twice this morning. Again, <laughs> we just had quite a heavy shower pass through. Everything's wet, but it's cleared up. I, got, I mean, I put my sunglasses on because I'm always used to running with them, but you know, I got a lightweight running jacket on. Just keep a little bit of the wind off me because uh, we will warm up. So, all right, well, I'm gonna jog down to the start, see if anybody's there. I'm mega early. Like, it's not gonna take me half an hour to jog down there. <laughs> but, uh, you know, we're meeting at a cafe, so I, I don't have to stand outside and get cold. So, anyway, see you down there. All right, it'll only take me like six minutes or so to jog down to the coffee shop where they're meeting up. There's no other runners there yet. It's only like 10 after, so I'm just gonna, walk around that was a pretty good clip the thrill of the downhill for the win so uh, we'll see who turns up I love walking around my town I don't talk about my work or my personal stuff here too much but I am a city planner and I work in development planning and urban design so it's kind of cool to walk around the town and see all the stuff I worked on biasly I think it looks fantastic so it's 20 after 9 no other runners here yet so i don't even know if i'm in the right spot <laughs> if i'm not what i'm gonna do is just go for a run along the seawall head back to dondurave and loop back around to my house get a run in anyway so still waiting see what happens okay it's 9 28 there's no runners in sight so i am abandoning west van run maybe next time maybe i'm in the wrong spot i don't know i've never run with a group before so uh, maybe i'll reach out to them on facebook but, uh, so I'm gonna do a loop through the dog park, come back along the seawall, and then loop, like I said, loop back up to my house. It'll be a fairly flat run and not too far, but that's okay because when I get home, I gotta pack up all my stuff to go open water swimming this afternoon. So I'm excited about that. And, um, have lunch, do some journaling. So, uh, let's go running. All right, change of plans. So running on the seawall is boring by yourself. I'm gonna cut up <laughs> behind a 
uh, field hockey fields <laughs> and cut up through the neighborhood. Legs are a little fatigued. I was quite busy yesterday, so smashing out PRs over the Lionsgate Bridge. <laughs> anyway, I digress. It's not fast <laughs> and certainly not impressive. Uh -uh. Anyway, so otherwise the run's okay. My legs do feel a little fatigued. So I'm, a, I'm not gonna lie, but that's okay. I'm out and uh, yeah, lots of stuff going on. This is the soccer field, actually. The field hockey fields are just, just west of this. All right, I gotta pay attention. I gotta run on the street. I'm walking the hills home. <laughs> I'm 4K in. I mean, it's fine. But I don't know. So what, I'll be like 5.5K in all in for running this morning? I mean, it's pretty good. Good enough, right? Good is good enough. So that's it. I'm gonna just hike these hills home, take it easy. My legs are fatigued, like I said. And uh, yeah, then uh, chill out for a bit, eat again. One of my favorite things to do. Uh, pack up or swim. I do have to get food at some point this weekend. My son was, he was, he was complaining. <laughs> To say he was just asking, but he was, he was complaining. All right, I'll uh, see you. I'm home. <laughs> okay, uh, so it was a little disappointing that I didn't find the group, but I'll do a little bit more, I'll do better research. Just maybe I was just at the wrong place. I'm pretty sure they meet every Saturday morning, but um, you know, maybe I was at the wrong coffee shop. I don't know, it doesn't matter. Anyway, I still had a great run. Um, my goal is to be able to do that run and then not have to walk the hill home. Um, although I am a little fatigued because, uh, you know, I am working on my running. Like I said in my last video, I'm building, I have a run forward, run focus, <laughs> run forward, run focus training schedule lined up for the fall. So, uh, yeah, I'm excited about that. And, uh, yeah, anyway, weather looks like it's holding. I hope, you know, it's not cold out, but it's not, you know, it's not overly warm either, so I think it'll be fine for swimming this afternoon. I'm actually pretty excited about it. So it's 10 o'clock now. Um, so I got a couple hours to chill out, eat, uh, journal, like I said, and um, I'll see you when I'm on my way to the beach. Okay. All right. And I'm off to the next adventure. <laughs> um, gonna head over to Kitsilano to meet up with the uh, outdoor swimming group. Um, normally they've, they've wrapped up for the season. They wrap up the end of August, but they put on a uh, fall special today. Um, I think they got lifeguards. The weather's still, they got, obviously they got lifeguards. The weather's still reasonably warm. I'm not quite sure. Anyway, um, I'm thrilled. Um, I did see an announcement saying suddenly they had a whole bunch of spots open up. Earlier this week when it was really warm and sunny, I had to be, I was on the waiting list for like four days before I got in, but with this weather, I'm not surprised to see people canceling, but I think it'll be fine. I brought my booties, my gloves, and my neoprene cap, um, just in case I feel like I need those things, but I might be okay. So we'll see how it is when we get there. So um, see you at the beach. So I'm at the beach. Uh, it's raining <laughs> quite heavily. Yeah, yeah. The water, I mean, the water looks pretty good. Like it looks flat. Uh, like there's no big rollers or anything crazy going on. So um, I imagine it's going to be very cold. So uh, this may be a short swim. We'll see what happens. And uh, see if anybody shows up. <laughs> Otherwise I'll uh, go pick up Jack and have coffee. <laughs> okay, I'll let you know what happens. <laughs> okay, the sky's opened and we had to come on the building, but uh, Vows is here, the people showed up, lifeguards just got here, so we're all just suiting up. Uh, it's just barely one o'clock now, so nice casual start. So we'll see how many people show up. Gar made it. Gar's here. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Oh, 
We'll tell them. We'll tell them. <laughs> All right, we're heading down. Water is 14.2 degrees, so uh, we'll see how it goes. All right, I'm all changed and dry. I'm trying to warm up. It's pretty cold. Somebody was saying the water was actually closer to 11 degrees and it kind of felt like it, like it was a little chilly out there. I had my neoprene gloves and booties and everything on, so um, I'm okay. So I'm just waiting for my noodle pot, pot noodle to cook. It's probably good. Have some hot chocolate, hang out with everybody. Yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. We're all smiling, we're all shivering, but it was a good time. All right. Good morning. It's early Sunday morning and I am off soon. Of course I'm making coffee. <laughs> I'll be off soon-ish, about half an hour or a little more than, uh, to meet up with my women's cycling group. Um, today is, it's September 24th and it's the last uh, club ride of WOW Women on Wheels for the season and that's it. So it's cloudy this morning, but cool. It's like 9 or 10 degrees out. Uh, I think we're supposed to get up to 15 or 16 today, but uh, that's probably won't be till later and I don't think we'll be out all day. So uh, I am dressing warm and warmly. I bought my beast layer on, arm, light, arm warmers, full like tights. Um, I'm gonna bring my club jacket for another layer. And if I get warm, I can, you know, take layers off, but staying warm on the bike is, can be challenging. It won't be too bad. We're gonna go out to Whitecliff Park here in Horseshoe Bay, or in uh, West Vancouver near Horseshoe Bay. And there's quite a bit of climbing, so, you know, we'll warm up on the way out there. It'll be fine. So I gotta get my stuff together, get myself ready, have breakfast, um, chuck some food in my bag. I'll be out. I won't be taking my GoPro because, well, maybe I will take it because we're going to do a cafe stop and maybe we'll, uh, maybe I'll do a little filming while we do stops and, um, that'll be fun. All right. So I'll see you later. It's chilly out, but the sun is coming up and it's beautiful. Today's going to be a great day. Beautiful. Big container ship heading into port, kind of cool. All right, I'm on the Broad Bridge. Sun is up and it is beautiful. Nice morning. Definitely has warmed up and not as cold. So gorgeous. I'm just loving life right now. So I'm at the meetup and I'm always the first one here. It's really weird because, I mean, we set off in apparently like 10 minutes, like it's 7.48 <laughs> or 12 minutes, I guess. And it's funny how no one's here and a lot of the women like live close to here, so. But anyway, I mean, I have to come all the way from the North Shore, so I like, you no, know, I, gotta, I gotta be here. It took me 38 minutes to get here. No PRs, nothing astounding, just a nice little cruise. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing everyone and um, kind of sad that this is our last ride because I feel like I haven't been really putting much in to my club this year because, uh, you know, life. I've had lots of other things going on that have taken away from my training uh, in general and uh, whew, boy, am I back in it now though. So I'm kind of like, ah, I can't believe this is the last ride. And Karen's not here. I thought she was back from Croatia. Oh, here comes someone. <laughs> All right, we'll see what's going on. Just Pauline, Alana, and I, so small group. I'm not supposed to be recording. Don't watch this. Pauline has dropped us again. <laughs> Pauline has dropped us again. <laughs> yeah, she has. That's okay. That's okay. They're just getting the coffee ordered. That's right. <laughs> It's Zeta. We found all the group too. You draw something, Polly. Oh, yeah. All right, coffee time. It's the 
battle at the coffee bar. <laughs> Bubbles! Bubbles for the season. Bubbles for the season wrap up. <laughs> <All right. laughs> it's a good group. Even though we got kicked outside, we're all freezing. <laughs> there we go. Hey, well done. <laughs> all right, we're heading out. We're cold. It was a good ride. Um, I'm close to home, so. Yeah. Yay. Hopefully, <laughs> harass you. What's my shitty week? All right, sounds good. Okay, I just left the group. It was a quick ride back. Got a nice little pace line of six of us, so that was fun. And I'm just doing the climb home. It was a great season closer for the ride. I'm glad I made it out. So I'll see you back there. Back home. <laughs> 11 o'clock in the morning, so uh, some good riding. Uh, two hours, 45 minutes. Great wrap up with the club, like I said, and made some plans to do a little off-season riding with some of the girls, so that's exciting. See how the weather cooperates this fall. Um, I think I'll wrap up this video here. I'll probably put it together. Uh, I think that was a fun weekend of training and getting myself back on track and i had a really good time with everybody with the club with jack oh, doing track repeats so i'm not sure what else is on the books for today i know he's been nagging me to go grocery shopping so i'm gonna go do that um anyway that's it i'm gonna wrap it up i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching go ahead and give me a thumbs up too okay see ya bye bye <laughs>